now that we are in our sacred space, let us find the quiet in our hearts so that we can talk to God. We light this candle because Jesus is the light of our world. Today we are going to read a story from sacred scripture about how God gave us animals to care for. God made the earth a long time ago. He put the first man in a garden. The garden was full of beautiful plants, but God thought that the man needed something else. God said, I don't want you to be alone. I will make some company for you. God made animals out of the earth. God made wild animals. He made birds that fly. God took the animals to the man. God said, what will you name these animals? The man named the animals. God wants us to watch over animals. They are one of his, they are one of the gifts from God to us. We also learn from animals. Animals have babies, just like people have babies. Animals take care of their babies and they teach their babies. Yes, God gave animals to parents just like he gave us parents and other people to care for us. God knows what we need and he gives it to us. Do you have a pet? Do you love your pet? Do you think pets feel like part of the family? Well, God made all animals. He created not just pets, but the animals in the zoo and the birds in the air and the wild animals in the forest and desert and ocean. Let's thank him in prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Dear God, thank you for making animals. They are warm and fuzzy, big and funny, small and fast, soft and sweet. There are so many different kinds of animals that we can't count them all. You make them all. Thank you. Thank you, God, our Father, for loving us so much. Please be with us as we learn, live, and love each day. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. That is the end of our prayer for today. But don't forget your religion homework. It was sent home this week in your packet. It's a fun pamphlet about caring for animals. Bye for now.